Thank you, Captain. Good luck out there.
Hi. Hello. Hey there, folks. Welcome to the stream. You're watching Ubisoft News Plays. I'm Chris. I'm Yusa. We are playing Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry. It's part of the Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection on Switch. Originally we were released as standalone DLC for Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. It's Freedom Cry, Yusuf. Who's this guy? Chris, this is Ottawale. Mm. He is... You'll recognize him, obviously, from Black Flag. Uh, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. We met is. him last week when we were streaming Black Flag and Rogue. Uh, he was... He's Edward's quartermaster. Yes. And, you know, spoilers for, like, a, a, an old game at this point. I don't think it counts as spoilers. But at, towards the end of Assassin's Creed 4, Chris, uh, at, uh, Edward meets the assassins. They try to sort of recruit him. Turns out, you know, the assassin life isn't for him. We've long known this. But it is for Ottawa. And he joins the assassins. He's about it. He sort of takes his leave from Edward. They go their separate ways, you know, as, as friends. Uh, but this picks up a little bit later, uh, quite a few years actually later, mm -hmm. where Alawale is an assassin, um, and he has found himself in Port-au-Prince now, mm. shipwrecked. On the uh, island of Santo Domingo, yes. now known as Haiti. Exactly. Uh, and there's a bit of a problem here, Chris. There's a lot of people in slavery. There's a lot of people that are being enslaved here. That's a problem. So yes, that is a problem. And so Alawale has to take it, or decides to take it upon himself to uh, help out people that are in a situation that he once was mm. when we first met him mm -hmm. in Assassin's Creed 4. Now he's in, he has the power to do something about it. Exactly. Like murder. Get him. Oh, two and one. Oh. They're like leaping past. I know, right? The stab and, stab and, the old stab and go. So we were in a plantation here. Yeah. Uh, we need to we take to shelter out until the day is done. Overseers. And once we do that, we free, we liberate the slaves, as you see. We've, we have liberated 30 slaves. We've recruited 10 maroons. So Bringing we're at, your totals up there to 90 and 22. Exactly. 90 liberated slaves, 22 recruited maroons. We have the summary of the plantation uh, liberation here. But then if you go into the liberation rewards, you see here that you actually progress in this game and you unlock new weapons, new pouches, new, new items basically by freeing slaves. Okay. So we've hit 90, that means we, we've passed 75, we got our dart pouch now. Uh, in 10 more, it looks like we get a new appearance. For your boat, the Experto Creed. Exactly. Is that how you say it? Yeah, sure. Let's go with that. Uh, I got a question in the chat, El Kashi, is it available on PC2, Matt Hydeus answering the question. Thank you, Matt. Yes, it is available on PC. It's also part of a Uplay Plus Play the game subscription. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, yep. Uh, it's also part of a Uplay Plus subscription. 
Thanks, Andy, for the uh, the goad there. We get caught up in the talking sometimes, but we gotta go do uh, stabbing. Stab Available it. on PC. Part of your Uplay Plus subscription. If you want to know more about Uplay Plus subscription service on PC that gets you over 100 Uplay games, go to uplayplus.com. Yeah. It's also uh, you can buy it on PS4 and Xbox One. Yeah, because this was part of Black Flag. But uh, what we're playing right now is the Rebel Collection on Switch. We streamed it last Friday. We played Assassin's Creed Black Flag and Assassin's Creed Rogue, and now we're playing Freedom Cry to like round out the package uh, and show you guys what's up. Yusuf, you're you're climbing this thing. I'm doing some windmill climbing, Chris. Okay. Are we getting synchronized? Oh, yes, we are. Yeah. Uh, it's not an Assassin's Creed stream without a synchronization. No. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Beautiful light over the jungle. I love it. Yeah. Chris, I like that you pointed out, you know, folks, if you didn't watch last week, we played Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag and Assassin's Creed Rogue because they are included in the Rebel Collection. So is this. As well, so you're getting to play three different assassins slash assassins turned Templars, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. and actually there's some Aveline content as well. So make that four. Is there? There is. All right. Um, but the beautiful thing about it is that the game, Chris, Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection, it's only forty dollars. Forty dollars is not a lot of dollars. No, you're getting two full games plus all of their like DLC, DLC content. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Not bad. I do say so. So you're, so you're chasing this guy down. Yes. A slave is making a run for it. The overseer's chase or the this thug is chasing him down. He doesn't have the stamina. Not while he's gonna catch up. Slow down. Oh, oh. <laughs> surprise! Hello, gentlemen. Who's around the corner? <laughs> Blunder bus. Blunder bus. Okay, fine, machete. So oh, Ottawali's yeah. got his own uh, new weapons. You know, it's not just a simple saber for this guy. It's the machete. Yeah, and his own combat animations, Ooh, which I love. Oh, the dome. Ottawa is so brutal. Oh, getting some For Honor vibes here. You know, some say he was the original Shigoki. <laughs> I feel like I, he would not, Shigoki would not be my first pick. For what Ottawale is. No? Hey, it's a, the, the club, the stature, it's a little, okay. it's a little different. Right. Feels like he's more of a, what would you say? Like a Kensei? Okay. But the sword, this sword's a little long. I don't know. Maybe a, maybe a Centurion? Centurion, yeah, up close and personal. Huh. All right, I gave you some blunderbuss there. Thank you. Uh, that was a little uh, combo kill. I haven't done that one before. Kaiser Dark Axe, welcome back to the stream. You be real, dude, moderator. Thank you for joining us. Glad to see you as always. Uh, your Ezio says, hey, Yusuf, we missed you on the Anno stream. Hey, what's up, uh, Yusuf is back. Uh, F Hat, he wants to know what resolution we are running this at. 1080. Yep, we're playing docked, so playing 1080 in docked mode, obviously. Yusuf's using the Pro Controller. Uh, when to go? This is. I mean, it's kind of like Black Flag, but it's Freedom Cry. It was a standalone DLC for Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, but, <laughs> oops. Uh -oh. We ran into a little bit of a hiccup. This is what it looks like. See, yeah, this is, it's on your Nintendo Switch next yeah. to your Pokemon games. <laughs> next to the other Pokemon games. That's how... The Switch was at 1080. I don't think that game is running at 1080. You don't think so? The Switch is set to 1080. We're not sure exactly what the game is running at, uh, according to our techni technical... Uh, overseer here, Andy, and also our Anno Maven. Your Ezio is saying Shigoki is an assassin. They're feeling, they're feeling the Shigoki okay, comparison. Okay, so For <laughs> Honor and Assassin's Creed did a crossover event where like Ezio and Cesare were in the game, mm -hmm. and it included assassin executions, Okay, like hidden blade executions, and we made a video about it, and the video began with the Shigoki performing like a very swift-looking assassination. Oh my god, that's true. So, confirm the Shigoki is an assassin. There we go. That's canon. Hi, Dragon Z. Welcome, or dragons. Welcome to the chat. Glad to have you all here. Uh, we're getting back into Freedom Cry here on the Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection on Switch. So you see, you got some Aveline content here okay. as well. We're jumping into Freedom Cry. Freedom Cry. All right, picking up where we left off. Yusuf, uh, we are not playing. We have are obviously not playing this right from the beginning. No. What can you give us? Just kind of like a brief 
overview of what has happened up to this point? Yeah. Real quick. So the game starts off, you're, uh, you're in a ship, you're captaining your ship with your crew. Uh, you're fighting off some Templars and uh, invading their ships. Mm -hmm. Boarding, I should say. Uh, sorry. I just saw two people that needed to die. Got him with the twosie. Mm. Love it. Uh, so there were some people, or uh, we, we, we boarded this uh, Templar ship. That guy went into the drink. Sorry. It's time to focus on the attacks, Yusuf. Yes. No more recap. Sorry, I'm a bit distracted. Oh, he, he, Push him he into the river. Oh, you got one. Oh, wait, he's back from the river. He's a little wet, but he's still feisty. Now he's hella dead. This guy, I mean, honestly, the cloak. He looks like Shigoki. <laughs> he's more of a Shigoki body type. Yeah. Uh, so, okay, we started off in a ship. We took down some Templar ships. We boarded their ship and stole a package. And that package had an address that brought us here. Because mm -hmm. uh, it was directed to a specific person, a Templar package. And so... Got him. We did. He's like, thanks, buddy. <laughs> I'm going to climb away on this roof now. See ya. So then uh, it brought us to Poro Prince. We spoke to the woman who the package was meant for. This is way too much detail. You're like giving me each question. All right, the overall is we arrived here and we are, we've decided to help liberate the slaves. Let's do it. We got an auction happening here. So, so this is actually kind of cool. I can just buy everyone and free them that way. Let's see it. Do it. You've you done a lot of murder. Let's see what happens when you go for the box. Fine. You can murder this guy afterwards. Okay, I like that. Don't shake my hand. You yeah, disgust no, 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 no. me. Okay. Trust in yourself. So they're automatically freed. Now just let them let get clear. These guys have been through a lot. You don't need to traumatize them by doing extra murder in front of them. Okay, okay now sirs. do the extra murder. <laughs> you thought you were getting away with my 500 oh, oh, real. Oh, no. I don't think so, buddy. I'll do it in right in front of all these guards. I don't care. I want a refund. I'm not going to be complicit in the horrible system. You think if I if I loot them afterwards, I'll get the 500 reales back? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. I think I... Who did I pay? This guy, maybe? I think that was just the goon standing nearby. I think it was one of the guys in the, the murder pile. In the murder pile? Yeah. Well, it wasn't him. Okay, this is... Two right here. So this might be. I think it might have been this other guy up here. It definitely wasn't Fancy Pants. Was yeah, you're right. I think it was him, but who knows? Maybe he like deposited it already. Nah. All right. Wasn't any of them. That's all right. Oh hi, man. How did y'all see me? Listen, maybe they heard the agonizing screams of a man's life getting choked out of him by a machete blade. That's possible. It's possible. Guys. Your Ezio is asking, uh, whatever happens with the duel with Boomer Mike? Oh, good question. Speaking of For Honor, uh, folks, if you don't know, Yusuf uh, started some beef with Mike on the Warrior's Den, the For Honor community stream. And it's going to go down. They're going to fight. Uh, oh, yeah. That's happening next week. Yep, it's happening Thursday, December 19th. On the Warrior's Den. Uh, Yusuf won't be, he's not going to be like on the couch, because that's couches in Montreal. Yeah. But couch it's going here. down. Tune in on Wednesday. We'll have more information for you on Yusuf's Brawl with Boomer Mike. Thank you for asking, though. Good memory. But it is like happening. It. Mike is going down. I'm a 31 banana. Hello! Do we stream R6 on here? We do sometimes stream R6 on here when there's like uh, seasonal events or new operators. Yusuf and I are the Ubis on the Ubisoft news team out of San Francisco, so we stream like a wide variety of Ubisoft games. Right now, it's the US Nationals for Rainbow Six, Thank so you. I believe you if you're looking for that stream, we that's gonna be on twitch.tv slash Rainbow Six. Let me just double check that for you. Uh, if you're looking for the competitive rainbow action that's happening all weekend in Las Vegas. All right, Chris, we're ready to start a new mission. Yeah, it's going down over there, if you want to see that stream. But hey, stick around. OK, Yusuf. We're having a clandestine meeting on the rooftops. 
in the middle Save of a storm. Mm. Human cargo makes for lucrative trade. I once hoped men of education could be made to see the cost. One would hope. The profit makes them ignorant. But no. With the right vessel, you could enter cross slave ships before they arrive. Or you would be free to leave. You have already paid more than you should. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That's what it's all about. All this rain is making me thirsty. I cannot choose for you. So, uh, Kaiser Dark Axe, are you Kaiser Dark Axe? Are you streaming on New Year's Eve or day? No, we'll be off for two weeks. We'll be streaming next week, Wednesday and Friday. Then we'll take two weeks off. We'll be back on January eighth. That's our streaming schedule. We'll remind you of that next week. Oh yeah. What's this? So we got one more week of us left. Some of your recruits. Lucky you. Salvage them. Tony, right? That you should. So, one word that you guys might have been seeing used here is maroons. And it's a word that I was actually not familiar with, but like when you were freeing, liberating slaves, it was like you liberated slaves or recruited maroons. So I looked it up. They have settlements where they would mix with the indigenous people, uh, but basically a maroon is uh, not a slave, not a lib, like they. They're not in the slavery, in the shackles of slavery. And we're involved in a lot of like historical, you know, uprisings, or, and also just like living separate from the plantation system and slavery system at the time. I'm just giving you the briefest of paraphrases, but uh, there's plenty of articles about it you can read up on. It's fascinating because it's not really something that I knew about. Yeah. yeah. And that's what's great about Assassin's Creed. It's this historical playground, but like you learn stuff about history or get inspired to like look up stuff about history as part of it. And other times you just wait for a guy to shoot you like calmly. Well, okay, you had a plan. I did. It looked to me like you were just about to take one in the chin. No, but uh, I, I put him to sleep. Yusuf has a plan for a short while, and then I put him to sleep forever. <laughs> we call that death. The final sleep. Okay, so I need to create a distraction, Chris, because I believe we're looking to commandeer a ship. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is DLC for Black Flag. Mm -hmm. We are in the Caribbean. We are. If a man has a ship, he has power. Good point. Also, hey. a machete and a blunderbuss. That's powerful. Well, you know, when you, when you start the game, you know, you're you're, you're participating in a, a naval battle. And Anawale says, you know, I left, when I joined the Brotherhood, I left life piracy behind. But occasionally the old ways come in handy. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, he has certainly learned quite a bit from Edward. And it's kind of like, you know, you move on to a new job, you might not be doing the same things at the new job you were doing at the previous job, but you still have some skills that you're bringing to bear. Exactly. You know? Exactly. The skills being, you know, cannon skills, Ship navigation skills, jumping murder skills, you know, transferable stuff. Exactly. Exactly. You can put it on your LinkedIn. Seems like this guy. Oh, oh gosh. man! Alright, well. There he goes! Oh. See you later! Oh! And he's falling off! Oh god, can we get a replay? Can we get a replay of that? Run it back! Oh my god. <laughs> Slow it down. Oh, oh yeah. the throw! No, the clothesline! Oh, oh, no. That's oh, one of the most badass so moves I feel like I've seen in an Assassin's the Creed. The clothesline on his way down. Ooh, you that know he's good. just flipping. He's flipping. Oh, that was nice. Let's go one more time. Let's one see more? it one more time. I want to see it one more time. Let's go slow. He's like, no. Yeah, let's we'll see you in the crotch. You're going over. Not before I crack you under the chin. You know that dude's landing on his neck. Oh. Uh, that was good. These animations, man. <laughs> a cheesier graphic for our instant replay. I mean, fire, something, something that's it, it like mirrors the hype that we uh, we get when we go when we call for the instant replay. Hidden <laughs> Okay. So we got pick up keg. This doesn't seem like a safe thing to be holding. Oh god, I lit it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't pick it up. Place it under a tower. Uh, that's fine. There's probably other kegs, right? Uh, sure. 
Yeah. Yeah, oh, there's one over there. Is this guy need to die? Nope, so he's fine. He's fine? Okay. He's All right. There's another the keg over there. He's keeping the peace. I've tried, I've given up being snaky. Does this one have the, uh, like, bonus? Sorry, ma'am. Uh, are there optional objectives? Yeah. Is that what you're asking? Yeah, yes, there are. Oh! Oh, the tackle! That was in traffic there. Yeah. Ma'am? Ma'am. Please, ma'am. Can you please? Thank you. You know, Google Maps sometimes says you weird places, man. That's true. You don't want to, you place you don't want to be. Either it's ways. like making you try to avoid traffic, but then you end up in a weird spot. It happens to all of us. All Just right. fortunately, it happens with less machetes, generally speaking. Here we go. You think one's enough? I think so. Oh. I mean, how many legs does this tower really? If you take out one of these tower legs, that tower is not going to be stable. That's a good point. Good point. It'll, it'll probably still stand with three, but it's not going to be like the structural integrity will be compromised. Oh, oh it's, it's on fire. Oh, yeah. The fire. What burns, Chris? Wait a minute. Even in the rain. You guys, oh, look at that thing. There's a real problem over there. I think we should. Oh, dang. I was just having a fun, wet night on my boat being wet. Now I got to go be wet on on shore. We got to go light the signal. Also, there's a huge sword fight on the beach. It's <laughs> all right. We created a distraction, Chris. They don't know we're here. <laughs> Reach the top of the mat. Yeah, in a second, all right? There's a bunch of guys here. I just need to chop them up. Oh, Atawale. Oof. He's got skills. He knows how to use a machete, that's for sure. Hello. Hello, gentlemen. Uh, see you later? Nope, they're all gonna die. Oh, that guy's going in the drink. He, I think he tripped. He's gonna climb back up. You go in the drink. Oh, oh God. You just get below the belt. Oh. oh. It was. Yeah. Oh, this person is still alive. Not anymore. Oh, no. He threw me up. Fighting in waist high water will be really challenging. I think so. I think that's why we're both getting out. Yusuf, have you ever heard of or seen a movie called Top Secret? I uh, neither of those things. Okay, so it's this uh, amusing movie from maybe the 80s or 90s. Uh, it's kind of like a, a screwball comedy okay. type deal. But there's I see one, how this reminds you of that. There's, there's one scene where they have, they've created an underwater set. It's a saloon. Okay. And so after plunging into the water, they all are underwater and they have a Western cowboy style bar fight underwater. Okay. It is superbly good and very silly. Chuck him off. Chuck, oh, Pfft. push him a little bit. That dude's center of gravity was all messed up. You just gave him a little shove. You know what? Sometimes uh, that happens, people. The balance is not right. That's true. Ooh. Okay. I need and, to get uh, up here. I feel like it, you know, especially if you're holding one of those big guns, those things, as I mentioned last week, are super heavy. Oh, yeah. They, oh, gosh. I mean, because they're basically just a huge mass of wood and steel. And the, I rem I'm remembering, uh, so I went to Pack South one year. And Pack South is in San Antonio. The Alamo is also in San Antonio. And I went to visit the Alamo, because, you know, historical situation. And at the Alamo, there was this, like, husband and wife team that had just, like, set up a table in the corner with all these old rifles. Huh. That like would have been used around in like the 1800s, around the time Davy Crockett, the defense of the Alamo, that the the war, etc. And so like, yeah, you want to hold one? Ah, uh, yeah, I was like, heck yeah, I want to hold one. Clunk! It was heavy. It was heavy. <laughs> it is so heavy. It's crazy. Bercy, welcome to the chat. Ezio Auditore, thank you for joining us. Glad to see you here. Chris, uh, we got a ship. We got a ship. Yeah, alert you. We got a ship. Yeah, we got a ship, we got a crew, they're stoked, morale is high. We got some skulls decorating the joint. Oh yeah. That's a big wheel. It's a big wheel for a big man. Big wheel for a big man. A lot of sails, dang. Oh, Let's fly in the black flag. Right. Like okay, it. there were optional objectives, didn't do any of them. You know what? I'm not an optional kind of guy, Chris. No man, this is not, this is not an optional objective kind of stream. No. We just take care of business. I love Adelaide's outfit. The outfits are so cool. The machete what you, what, in the back. What do you like about it? 
Uh, big fan of the red sash. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, nice. How it feels very era appropriate. I like the sleeveless. Yes. Vibe also. Alright. So I gotta liberate a slave ship. Because Chris, you know that ships were the primary method of transportation. Indeed, especially across the ocean. Yes. The Middle Passage, as I believe it was called. The tri Triangle Trade? Triangle Trade. I'm trying to remember these terms. Is that like a Bermuda Triangle? No, it was like, uh, it was like from Africa, slaves from Africa to the West Indies, cotton from the West Indies to England, I don't know. Gold from Spain to, I don't know. I'm not exactly no sure. Accepted me as their captain I'll look it up. Kaiser Dark Axe saying his birthday, or her birthday, is on New Year's Eve. Hey, happy almost birthday, Kaiser Dark Axe. Coming up. You got plans? Do you celebrate your birthday? Do you, like, wrap it into the New Year's I Eve celebration? I always wonder that about people with birthdays around the holidays. Yep, yep, you know? yep. Like, like if, if your birthday is near Christmas, you just get what, that one gift? Mm -hmm. Hey, Pink Spoofer, welcome to the chat. Glad to see you. Thanks for joining us. Well Folks, by the way, if you're watching on YouTube or Mixer, we're chatting on twitch.tv slash Ubisoft. You're welcome to join us there or stick right where you are. We're glad to have you either way. Yes, Yusuf, back to the birthday and holiday. Actually, mm -hmm. hold on. I'm really digging this like foggy, like sailing off into the kind of unknown vibe here. Oh yeah. Because that's what it looked like this morning when I woke up. It was very foggy <laughs> in the East Bay. I was say, were you surrounded by water? Uh, well, the water was not, the water not so much. The, the large sails, not so much. But the like, you know, that kind of moody, like close feeling you get when it's real foggy. For or sure. when it's like snowing or raining. It kind of closes your world in a little bit. All right, I think we're coming up on the slave ship. Do not attack slave ships. They do not need to be damaged before being boarded. Don't attack them. You Thank said. you for reading that. I did not notice that. Yeah, man. Also because... There's probably some slaves in there. Well, yeah. You're having a bad time already. You don't need to make it worse with grape shot. Good point. Good point. Okay, this they got a little bit of a flotilla here. Ooh, the chain shot. Nice. Yes, Ready to fire. All right. Ooh, they're mad. They're mad. It's naval. It's naval combat time, folks. Boat murders. Kaiser Dark Axe is trying to plan something. Good luck. I hope you have a good time. Ooh, yeah. Hit him in the rear. That's where they, is that where they store the powder? Uh-oh. Oh, did seems I run like it? You, I ran into it. Seems like you may have rammed the slave ship. All right, well, Some who put it there? ramming. Keep your head on a swivel, Yusuf. Fair. I keep my guns on a swivel, if you know what I mean. Keep my guns on a swivel. Keep my cannons on that swivel. Broadsides. Oh. Ooh, we got a little precision shooting action here. Get him. Get him. These guys are not having a good time. Nope. One, One more. more. One more the there we go. To the briny, deep, yet dirty dogs. Down ye go. And Chris, the devil take ya. If you were gonna be a pirate. Okay. I'm gonna be a pirate. Uh, what would your name be? That My would name? strike fear into the hearts of all those Ooh, who would dare well, cross your path. My name, as you see here, Chris Waters. Already somewhat nautical themed. Yes, there's a lot you could do with it. There's a lot people do try to do with it. I'm sure. Uh, I don't know if you folks have one of those last names that it's like easy to make a joke or a comment about. I feel like McGee, you don't really. No, no. But uh, people do. I'm lucky if people know how to pronounce it. <laughs> yeah. Did I do it right? You did? All right. Nailed it. Well, one should hope after three years of working together <laughs> yes. that I would get it right. And I did. Waters, mm. like the so. The temptation a lot of people have is to add like an adjective: bloody waters, briny waters, okay, raging waters. Ah, Top gallant, royal studs. but I don't know. I feel like what? What do you think is a good attribute of a pirate name? Ooh, it's a pirate hunter on me. Uh, so it needs to inspire fear. Okay. Uh, it needs to... It's rescue time, baby! Rescue time. Gun oh, quick. dang! He was raising his hand! Hey, you over there, you can't, you can't do that! It's a good way to get shot. Good way to get shot. You got a twofer? Twosie! All right, we're gonna board. I like my killing up close, anyway. Yeah. 
Also, you know, fun to mix it up on the sh surface of a boat. Michael says, my favorite Assassin's Creed. Are you, referring to the, are you referring to this one, Michael? Seems like. It's a good one. Oh! Off the ship. Get off the ship. The it leaping me knee. Dang. That's good. Uh-oh. I don't think somebody... Nope. I feel like if I was a pirate, I would do a lot of uh, shanty singing, and so maybe my name would be, like, song or singing related. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We have freed them. Huzzah! Now, personally, this is up to me. This is a slave ship run by slavers. It's over now. You can go. I wouldn't leave any of them alive. would not let those guys nope. surrender. Nope. No, I mean, look at this. Just... Just monstrous. The conditions on a slave ship, absolutely atrocious. Just the whole operation, a blight on the history of humankind. Yes. So we have liberated all the slaves. I think we only recruited four of the possible ten maroons because I may have run into the ship. Light collisions, but dang. But yeah, we, we got, made a lot of progress there. Okay, got some more stuff Ooh. from for the Experto Creed. That's the name of your boat. Iron Ram. All right, cool. So, uh, because we were in the way there, you, you unlocked a few things. I did. New customization item for your boat, an iron ram for your boat, another pouch of some sort. Uh, but you gotta like pick that up at a store, I believe. It doesn't just automatically unlock. So we got some pirate hunters on what right now. What is this? It, the red cross sword seems ominous to me. Pirate hunters. Okay, okay, okay. But can you just tell them you're retired, you're not a pirate anymore? And they'll I know. Like, oh, so sorry for the... Excuse me, folks. I'm, the a, I'm an assassin. Oh, uh, yeah, I've got my... The flag up there clearly has an assassin symbol on it, buddy. I don't know what you're doing here, No but, pirates uh, here. Ooh. That seemed like a lot of explosions on their boat. Yeah. They're down to half health. I've, so I've never, I've never sailed a ship myself. But from my understanding, explosions are a bad thing. Bad thing, like broad in most walks of life. Yeah, yeah. Should we board? Let's board. Boats out. Let's get moving. Mm. Kaiser Dark asks suggests Edward Waters. I mean, that would be a very like English take on a pirate name. But did, did they just say Edward because of Edward Kenway? Or I, what's it? Blackbeard's name Edward? Oh, was it? No, it might have been Robert. Something teach, I feel like. Uh, thatch. Right? Blackbeard teach. Mm, Edward teach. Alternative, teach. Alternatively spelled Edward thatch. Ah. Better known as Blackbeard. So we're both right. The best case scenario. <laughs> Get him. Oh no! Uh oh. Wow. All right. As well, that ye, was rude. As ye throw enemies into the drink, so shall ye be thrown into the drink, as they say. Into the drink. Yeah. That's a, that's a fun slang term for so I could, the water. I could, I could do this. Oh, no. You're going to close range blunderbuss it? Oh. Some right. I, lo I, lost, I, I lost the crew member in that. Mild collateral damage. They knew what they signed. Exactly. Ooh. All right. I love the, the, the fire is doing some very dramatic underlighting here to highlight your victory. Pirate hunters. What do, what do we do with them? I mean... I think oh. we, we reset the wand a little. I mean, the, the ship is full health. I don't, need, I don't need to repair it. No, no, we're fine. Just uh, tell your buddies to don't come around here no more. Yeah. See? Yeah. There's no more contracts. Join us or die. No need. Look at that blunderbuss on his back. That's big. I want to see some more blunderbussing. Blunderbussing? All right, it's fair. Let's get back to shore, then. All right. V3G in the chat is uh, talking about sort of this game being action-y, RPG-y, sort of where this falls in the uh, in the Assassin's Creed kind of balance. Like, what what's the, what do you say that is the main thrust of Freedom Cry usage? I'd say it's definitely an action and adventure game. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. I think most Assassin's Creeds are until you really start getting into Origins and then for sure Odyssey. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, pre, pre Origins AC games, very much in the action and adventure genre. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Where are you off to now? 
so I believe I'm headed back to shore. Uh, I believe Portal Prince. You can check our map. You got a map? Ooh, got a map. Okay. Got a map. Yep, Portal Prince. There it is. They got chests there. They got chests there. So you can see. Okay. Get a, get a decent uh, idea of the map. Again, this is standalone DLC to uh, Black Flag, so you're not getting a giant, massive Caribbean like you got in that game, but a sizable chunk nonetheless. Sizable. Yeah. Plenty of places to for pirates to hide and oh, be yes. sought out by other marauding pirates. When you see an island like that, do you think, hey, that'd be cool to like go there and climb on it? Uh, I mean, it is certainly possible. Not like in this game specifically, but just like in general. Oh, in general, no, like, never. See pictures of like Ha Long Bay in Vietnam, and you're like, I want to get up, get up on it. I have never thought that. Is that a I kinda common feel occurrence it. you have? I Are you confident it. enough in your climbing abilities? Oh no, I, there's no way I can climb up, up the whole thing. That's crazy. You That's not actually what I want to do. I guess I just want to like get onto the island and like poke around a little. Okay, well, fair. Yes, in that <laughs> case, yes. You made climbing seem like it was a big part of this. So we're traveling with the wind right now, so we're making good time. V3G, uh, so we are currently playing Freedom Cry. This was DLC originally released for Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. Standalone DLC, you know, it's not one of those ones that you, requires the base game to own. Uh, so you can buy it standalone now on PC, PS4, or Xbox One. We are playing it as part of the Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection, which is out now for Nintendo Switch. Rebel yes. Collection includes Black Flag, Rogue and Freedom Cry, and a couple other Assassin's Creed goodies in there, all bundled in to one game. Yep. It's only $40, too. And it's, it's only 40 bucks. A lot of really good USD, Assassin's Creed content. USD. I mean, we're local here. Sure. We're in good San point. Francisco. All currencies and times will be Pacific Time USD. Crimson Waters. Ooh, I like that from Kaiser Dark Axe. Decent suggestion. I like it. That's a good one. But then wouldn't people just call me Crim for short? I'm not, I don't know about that. I mean, I don't think people call Blackbeard just black. Yep. That, well, I appreciate you imagining that I would have the stature of Blackbeard such that people would say my full name on everything. I mean, when Crimson Waters comes, comes around, you pay attention. Mm -hmm. So this guy has a key. Is that you, you get the key to like unlock these slaves here? Yep. Oh, yeah, jail. Steal the key from the guard. Maybe next time we try to steal the key from the guard. Chris, uh, I don't know why I would uh, do that. I don't. Hold on. Sorry, move my microphone around. I'm, I'm stealing it from his corpse. Does that count? That's true. Get it. Let's go. Thank you. We can only put a stop to this by helping each other. Dang, you are making an impact. Oh yeah. 186 liberated slaves already. I believe in you. Well, we got, you know, there's quite a few on that ship. A whole ship's worth. That's efficiency. And then we we have now liberated two plantations as well, so you know, quite a bit. Oh no! So we kind of came in at the beginning of the stream. You were finishing a plantation takedown. Yep. What? How would you sort of? Uh, what would you say like a plantation takedown is like? Is it just kind of like, you know, you're in a big area, you kind of trying to methodically take everyone down. You're like looking out for alarm bells and stuff. Like, yeah. So uh, like Black Flag, I had similar types of. Uh, uh, events where you would you would just go and you would just pillage from the plantations. Mm -hmm. um, here you're doing it with like the uh, intent of liberating the slaves there. So you basically go around and I try to always stealthily take out as many of the overseers, like the guards, as possible. Uh, because if I believe if you do it unsneakily, then they will start to like kill the slaves. Oh, dang! Uh, and you won't be able to free as many. Yeah, of them. that sounds right. Yeah. Knock, knock. All right, so we're checking back in. This was the, the lady we first met, uh, I believe, on our arrival, yes. We're at the bar. Oh my goodness, look at this lady. She's gorgeous. I love the hair wrap. Monsieur She's Adam. clearly in charge, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She's a boss, no doubt. I do not know how much longer I'll be able to continue. The Maroons are outstanding warriors. Augustine mm -hmm. has provided the me Maroons. with everything I might need to get by until I return to my brothers. So that's sort of Adewale's conflict here, right? Mm -hmm. He is 
he wants to be, be while engaged in this fight for, for freedom here and helping the Maroons, but he also is a word. he's a member of the Brotherhood. Yeah. He's an assassin, and the Brotherhood has plans, and he is dedicated to those. Yeah. So that he is in search of Templars. Mm -hmm. You have maintained your freedom among the French by the deft handling of your indispensable business. Mm. I respect you highly. What would be a fool respect. to trust anyone so clever so soon? Who's got to stay cagey? She's too clever. Listen, can't trust anybody like that. That's a, that's a good point. Since you cannot provide me with the one thing I truly desire, I hope to what does she want to now? Demonstrate some respect, by some demonstrate some respect for her. I would consider. It. Okay, all right. I need a careful. Although I might own the title of Buffett's assassin. I must know what distracts him and why he enforces. Right. Strong him. argument right here. Every I know. Look at that tricep. Those that's delts. Oof. Those are muscles. I share your curiosity. Muscle words. Look at his chest. Look at those packs right now. You got a whole quarter between space. those. Perhaps Who would give him a run for his money? There is some Bayek? Bayek? Alexios? I mean, Cassandra's got them arms. That's true. That is for sure true. There aren't very many sleeveless assassins, Please. though. Change into Showing off the guns. Yeah. Okay, it's going to be a stealthy time here. It does seem We're that gonna way. We're going to have to observe the governor. Put a disguise on. A Shadow Booster, Max. good to see you in the what chat. Says, I love Black Flag and Rogue, I feel, are the capture? best. Indignity. Oh, well, there you go. Rebel Collection. Two great games. Allies. They are in the same package along with Freedom Cry and the Rebel Collection, which is what we're playing now. Are we all pawns to you? <laughs> you should be so lucky. Spider says they're playing uh, AC3 and Black Flag. Oh, nice. AC3 recently remastered. Nice. How are you enjoying it? What, what's, what's one thing you like about AC3 that you're playing right now, Spider? I'm curious. I want to know. Also, you're playing them at the same time? AC3 and No, they clarified to you be real, dude. They're just playing AC3 right now. Fast. Uh, bars ill. This is on Switch, correct. We're playing Freedom Cry. It's part of Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection on Nintendo Switch. It includes Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, Assassin's Creed Rogue, Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry, and some other goodies. Bastion, where are we going? So she just said, I've never met an overseer that could tell us two slaves apart. Mm -hmm. So we're going to take advantage of that. Because you're, are you dressed in like some slave garb here? I am. Yeah, you're going to go undercover. See, not always got like the, the eight pack showing. Oh, geez, Here you're right. He, he, all right, I'm calling it Be Buffest Be Assassin. Buffest Assassin, you heard it here first. It's official. Adewale, Buffest Assassin. Yeah, I could, uh, I could carry this box. Oh, yeah. Slide right into yep. the line. It's just, uh, just me. Be cool. What's going on back there? One in line. Be cool, man. Just carrying a box. They don't even realize like I'm you. an entirely different person. What do you think's in that box? Uh. Who are you? A friend. Peaches. Peaches? Yeah. Sent down from Georgia for the governor's mansion. A treat for his. No. Wealthy entourage. Money. Yep. Sure. I'm doing a really good job staying in line. Barzil says, got all of them on PC, playing now AC3 as well on Switch. Ooh. All right. Hello, governor. I'm Big Tigger. Nice. Ah, the pirate bundle, Barzil. The pirate bundle. I like it. Drop the crate. Whoa. Pick up that, that was unnecessary. Pick up that can. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to remember your face. I'm going to murder you first. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm making a list, checking it twice. Oh yeah. Gonna find out who I murder. Something, something nice. Nailed it. Got it. <laughs> Folks, this is why I don't freestyle. <laughs> Hi, Hidden Blade. Welcome to the chat. Stoked to have you here, especially with such an appropriate name. The Sugar Coder says, haven't played AC game in a long time, but picked up Assassin's Creed Odyssey and love it. Hey, nice. Odyssey's a fantastic game. It's so good. All right, so you're walking, you're blending in here on the plantation. 
Slave's doing some work. Doing some woodworking? Yeah, cool. I can I can help you I guys can, out. I can hammer. Friend, does the guard change often? As often as night moves to day. Thank you. Boom. Put a lot of trust in this guy's aim. We all we got, Chris, as they say. We all we, we, all got. we got. Barzil saying Black Flag and Rogue are, Rogue are my favorite by far. Hey, all right. You must like boats. And also, you know, the rest of the game. It's yeah. good. Okay, dude. Alarm bells will cause desynchronization. Locate the governor in the mansion. Well, it's not an alarm bell. Nope. All right. Well, can we pick up this weapon? All right. Okie dokie. It's on now. I'm seeing a lot of red on your mini map, though. Oh, you, yeah. Sure are. So it's gonna get a little, it's gonna get a little hairy here, folks. All right, we're gonna lure him out of this bush. Come over here to the whistling bush. Nothing bad ever happened in the whistling bush. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, you're dead. I think that way, it, that was the guy. What? Oh, the guy that you called out? <laughs> yeah. Let's take a look. Let's get an instant replay, look at his face. Oh yeah, he was in front of the mansion. That bandana, look at that. I think that was the guy. Adewale looks him in the eyes, and he knows. All right, so I think we gotta go a bit more stealthy than I'm approaching this right now. I'm gonna head around this way. Maybe start doing some climber clambin. Cl climbing, clambering. Some, some zip zocks. <laughs> zip zogging is a combat maneuver, Yusuf. You wanna keep it stealthy. Well, we zip zock that first guy, that's, that's for sure. For sure. All right, I also want this chest, because I'm greedy. Give me the loot. Where do you, I, I don't even have anywhere to put the money right now. It's fine. Oh, dang. Oh, that was a lot. That is a glad hefty we, sum. Glad we stopped. Uh, I feel like that guy's going to see you through the lattice work. He's hey, definitely going to see you. It, oh, Yusuf. Oh, it's bad. Don't let him. Don't, don't let him ring the alarm bell. Oh, ow. The uppercut. Oh, right to the groin. Oh, to the back of the head. Oh. All right. Who needs weapons, Chris? <sighs> Not Adewale. He's got these. Hush, little baby. Don't go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Should we, should we just let him sleep? Or can you throw him in the river? Oh, I kick him in the kidneys. <laughs> that killed him. That was such a strong, powerful kick. <laughs> All right. Oh no, someone saw me. Right. Get him! Oh, he's, he's got a fancy hat. Ooh. All right, luckily no one's ringing the bells. That guy said exclamation point. <laughs> Look at this trail of writhing bodies. <laughs> I'm gonna find the governor! If Ooh. you please. Dang, Adi Wally can throw a punch. Buffest assassin. The key what is, the, key is the follow through, you know? Boom! See that again? I love it. Oh, it's easy dropping time. Maybe can you like that? I heard you gave Francis a pearly jewel worth more than half the fleet. Okay. Does this account for the missing funds? I heard you gave Bastion girl a jewel worth more than the fleet. Listening from mm, the rooftops. Mm, mm, mm. We got Vigadego, Vigadego. Oh, no, I'm not, I'm not in the area. What? Oh, I wasn't in, okay. Yusuf, that made sense. Honestly, logically, that made sense. I wasn't, I was on top of the rooftops. Who are you going to hear through a rooftop? Not Someone many with a lot of bass in their voice, maybe? Possibly, possibly. Okay, we got to be more sly. Okay, I'm seeing this, drum. like, yeah, this yeah, side roof action here. I heard you gave Bastion's girl you were Viga Diomes. Is that how you say her Twitch name? It's like... You made, took video games and made it into a real tongue twister. <laughs> Says they played all games on PS3 and got a new PC at the beginning of the year, so now you're gonna play the games on PC. Ooh, exciting. If you measure every father, I mean, Yeah, you be real dude, also having trouble with it. I'm saying, right? It's tricky. Mission accomplished. All right, reach the hiding spot. But there's a guy there. Oh, the top rope! <laughs> that was so that was so high up. 
Dude. You know, when you have something to break your fall. Like a human. Like a human body. I feel like you might need to get a little closer to eavesdrop. I don't know. It's only going this bush. Yeah, but your objective is updated. I love that dramatic exit from the bush. I'm here! <laughs> Are you trying to stutter? The treaty between our nations is fragile. We cannot afford any suspicion of smuggling. Are you trying to start a war? Thank God for these well-placed bushes. Thank you for the offer, but I have an excuse. Don't thank God, Yusuf. Thank you, Ubisoft. I like these flowers, though. This is like a... Oh. This is like a very... Oh! I gotta take opportune moments. All right. To zip from cover to cover. Okay. Okay, all right. Return to Bastien. I mean... Oh, I saw, I have optional objectives. Liberate the slaves and kill the overseer. Yeah, so I, I think, I don't think that means I did kill the person I pushed, that pushed me. No, but he wasn't the overseer. Oh. Uh, he was just like... So I did get him, that's what you're telling me. Joe Baloney. Oh yeah, you got this. All right, let's get rid of this. You got the guy you wanted to get. You have not got the overseer. Okay. I want to try and take out these bells. Ring, ding, dong. Oh, ding, 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 ding dong. Open. Please don't ring the bells. I like how you're sticking with the fisticuffs. Oh yeah, they, they've been working for me. They definitely have been. Hello, friend. I'll become anonymous to interact. Ooh, ooh, some Those are some action. good moves. I've always been well trained by the assassins. Seriously. Okay. Strong combat training. We don't have to worry about the bells anymore. Well, I think the bells was also like uh, before you got the information. Well, true, but I still don't want them going off. That's fair. I wonder where this overseer guy is going to be. Slave barracks are where you were before, I presume? I don't know thing he bounced off. He chucked him into the marble. Oh, he's not, he's not dead? Wall. No, he's just mildly concussed. Into the drink. Into the drink. Into oh. the drink. Hey. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. Here we go. Back on track. Yusuf. Sorry. Is about is about that paper. Give me the loot. Yo, these chests. The governor holding out on us. Lucrative. Let's see that chest. Ooh. Oh, 3,000 reales. I think it's reales. Reals? Reals. Keeping it real. Real currency. <laughs> he looks like he could have been the foreman or whatever. Oh, it's over here. This Clarice LaRue, welcome to the chat. Said they've played almost every AC game released. Dang. Which ones have you not played? Do you have, well, I guess the question is, do you have any more on your agenda to play? Or are you like, I'm feeling good with my AC play? Because that's a lot. Are you liber have they been liberated? Uh, let's double check that. Yes. So I need to kill the overseer still. Who led the slaves. Mm, was it that guy? Was it you? It was definitely one of these guys with the hat. I wonder if I'm just knocking them out, Yeah, though, you're and for not sure killing not killing them. him. Well, I'm killing some of them. Yes. Go just go start chopping these dudes with swords. I feel like you're not killing them with a kick to the gut. Well, the prompt says assassinate when I push that button. Someone on the roof. Maybe, maybe that was them. Someone's on the roof? I don't think an overseer would go up to the roof. I feel like an overseer would How be like... How else are you going to oversee? Yeah. You didn't think about that, no, did, did you? He's got a good point, folks. Real good point. Is that him? I don't think so. Hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Am I missing anybody? If you're I'm alive, sorry. yell. I'm telling you, man. Oh, he's maybe probably one of these dudes that you knocked unconscious. I thought I killed most of them. The writhing ones? Oh, well. Return right. to Bastien. OK, well, let's kill these guys out front first. Maybe, the, maybe he's, he's one of them. Hey, you. Oh, oh dang, there's a bunch of them out there. 
Oh gosh. Yusuf, you're in a tight spot. I believe in you though. You can also run away. What kind of slave liberator would I be? Oh, One gosh. who doesn't die? From getting chopped? Two bits? Oh. Oh no! Yusuf! I got it, I got it, I got this! Yusuf! You Believe in me, chat! Do it! I need you! Ooh! Oh, we got him! That? We got him! Got him! From the brink of death, Adewale fights Woo. back, defeating the foul overseers. See, if I ran away too, we wouldn't have gotten the optional objective. Yusuf, if you stuck it out, you done me proud. You see, Chris? You well see. Well done. That's what per perseverance gets you. I do see. I'm inspired. As you should be. As you should be. We need like an applause sound effect. Where's our applause sound effect? What we need is a live studio audience, Andy. Ooh. That's you. 2020. 2020 goals. <laughs> Ah, uh, so she runs a brothel? That's exactly, say? that's exactly what she runs. She's the madame. We were led here, we were told to go to the brothel. Alors, what have you nice comeback, says Wiley MTC. Despite his hey, guy, thank you. Mm -hmm. Just have to focus a little bit, you know? Getting distracted. What makes you believe you need him? I keep my friends close, my enemies close. Mm, is this the jewel that that guy was talking about that we overheard? Maybe, oh, maybe not. Yeah. What have you learned about the governor? A bold-faced scientist, Godin, hounds the governor for funds. Something about an expedition, navigational secrets. Why is this the first time I hear? There's scientists in this game, Yusuf. I mean, there was always scientists, Chris. There, are, there have been scientists. You think just because they didn't have beakers and, and other tongs and science things? Sure. I know science words. I admit it's <laughs> uh, you think just because all that didn't exist, they didn't have scientists? He wasn't in a white cloak. How am I supposed to know? Yes. I don't know. It's another I science word. Leave it's like another beaker. science word? <laughs> Test tube. Test tube? Sure. Microscope. I feel like it's computers at this point. You don't, think, you don't think they're using test tubes and beakers and microscopes? Sure, yeah. They do. They do. They do do. But they also use those, like, centrifuges. Uh, that's a thing. And that's one. Things that spin mm -hmm. really fast. Large, hat, large mm -hmm. Hadron Collider. Scientists are always using that thing. I have a friend who has a PhD in chemistry, and I'm sure mm -hmm. if he were to hear me saying this, he'd be upset with me. <laughs> Just but it's because I don't know how just smart you are, Sergey. I can't appreciate how smart you are because you're so much smarter than me. Sergey, you've got to start teaching this guy some vocab. Am I also convinced that Sergey is a spy? A little bit. Yusuf, I feel like that is not something you want to say on a live stream. What if he is? Problems. I mean, I accuse him of it all the time. <laughs> well then. <laughs> He's like weirdly like athletic and like spry and like can just like do backflips and shit. Yeah, yeah. Backflips are cool. And is super smart, right? Hey, man. That's exactly what a spy would do. Sounds like a cool dude. All right. A scientific inquiry. It's science time. All they right. heard us. They knew. Yusuf, we might be getting out of our depth here with all this science talk. Yes, mm. I would agree. <laughs> I studied art. Bastien. I feel we lost you to the bitterness of depression. Never. Those arrogant These arrogant men cannot, cannot cut me out of my own network. The cost is too great for the slaves. And for your pride. What I'm Big it? Tigger is wondering so if Sergei is actually Whatever in has inspired it, I'm glad to hear the fight back in what your voice. What do you voice. think? You know, quite possible. Quite nimble possible. and He's acrobatic. Nimble. Have yep. you seen Besides, him just like they... scurry up a building like it's no what thing? Up a building? No. Have you been like? But I have seen him scurry. Sergey, how did you get into my second story apartment? I didn't even. I mean, I'm glad to see you, but he is very stealthy. It's like you turn around, and you're like, oh, Sergey, you're there. Big Tigger might be onto something here. Kept me informed. Mm-hmm. 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 All I'm saying is, if I needed an antidote to poison. I had been poisoned, and I needed an antidote. He's the first person. He's the guy you go to. Yusuf, I see a synchronization point nearby here. 
You mean this that's one right that, in front of me? Yeah, that's what that eagle means, right? Yes. Can we sink it? Well, because it is white, Chris, that means it has already been sent. Well, crud. It's nice to have my uh, fatigues back. Ooh. That yeah, nice. all that wearing sleeves was really getting you down. It really was. You gotta let these dogs breathe. Also, I realized I, I was still fighting with my fists. Not anymore. It's machete time. Also, can we see some more blunderbuss, please? Okay, well, let me... Oh, no, I want it. Human shield, human shield. There we go. Okay, you, you want me to blunderbuss this yes, guy? Yes, I for sure do. All right. Oh, that was rude. <laughs> see, now he's giving you a reason. Dang! Well, so the real power of the blunderbuss, which I need to showcase, is in its ability to take out multiple people. Well, it looks like there's a whole clutch of dudes right over there. All right. Right there, boom, blunder their buses. That, that was, was pretty good. Four. Can we get a replay of that? Where's no, the answer no, replay? No, no. That was four dudes with one bus. Boom, boom, boom. Blam. Oh. Wait, I also just accidentally blunderbussed this guy. I don't know if the stream saw that. What? No, we were on the replay. No. All right. Look at all these guys. Dude. Oh, he's already. Oh, the, the machete. He is so gnarly. Blunder bussin'. I mean, the machete's doing work. Oh, it is, but... Oh, no! He's not dead! He's not dead. You want to do some fancy bussin'. Locked it! Oh, I got him now. Okay. Oh, I gotta reload! <laughs> not, a t not a good time to reload. All right. Reload time's not strong. We're not Not one of the blunder bussin's strengths. You know what? You never have to reload. A machete. A machete. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fantastic. Yusuf, this is delightful. I'm enjoying it very much. I've had a good time. Uh, I feel like we're at a point where another mission is coming up. Uh, are you feeling like you want to keep going, play a little more, get in on that Harbor Master eavesdropping, or are you feeling like maybe this is a nice time to go appreciate a, a good view? And uh, I think uh, we can end it on... Uh, on this right here. Oh, excuse me, sir. Well, I'm just uh, gonna reload. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. All right. Savage. This feels like a good place. Love it. To wrap up. Bust that blunder. Folks, you've been watching us play Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry. It's included in Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection, which is what we're playing on Nintendo Switch, which has Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, Assassin's Creed Rogue, and some bonus goodies for you. That's out on Switch. If you want to play Freedom Cry but not get this one, it's on PC, Xbox One, and PS4. Check it out. Yusuf? Chris? Uh, th final thoughts on Adewale and your adventures here? Uh, buffest assassin, by far. For sure the buffest assassin. Inarguable. Four, four dudes down with one blunderbuss shot. That was delightful. An excellent shot with the, the blunderbuss. <laughs> Surgical, you could say, with it. All right, folks. We will be back next week on Wednesday. Same time, same station, 10 a.m. We'll be streaming two more days next week before the holidays. Please come back and join us. And until then, uh, have a great weekend. Take care, y'all. Bye. Huh? Want to keep waving? Yeah. Andy, is he going to make me wave? Like, continually? Yeah. Wave so continue perpetually. Continue to wave. Perpetual waves. Uh, can I, I switch hands? Again. Hold on. Let's <laughs> it We're trying to get the blunderbuss back. Andy loves it too much. Can we see? He is trolling, Elias. I, I keep waving. It's making me wave. Come on. All right, here we go. Bye, bars. Bye, Clarice. There it is. Come on. Oh, they all fall down.